What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, Capital Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't fly, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with us. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. Just saying, saying, saying. Um, this is daily tea for today. Well, the tea, the daily tea, whatever, whatever. Um, I honestly have gotten a plethora of downloads in today. A plethora. So there's a lot going on in the internet space. So I'm just going to honestly just do these readings and just offload them. So tea, uh, I think I'm going to put them under the tea on the playlist. So if you want to go back, if you just don't pop up on the channel and it playlist, I mean, it just scrolls down. You can click on the playlist under the T and they'll be there. Just saying. All right. Love you guys. Thanks for all the shares of my content. Thanks for um, all the love and support to the channel. You guys are the bestest. Okay. So. <sighs> so the channel message I received. Uh, okay. So this is one of several. Um, before I click the camera on. So I'm going to do them all separate to see if I get any other channelings with them. But the first one I received was, um, I heard a um, Capricorn and a Virgo. A Capricorn and a Virgo is about to start experiencing, I heard they already have, and they're about to start experiencing even more severe chaos in their life. Um, I heard some, like it was two severes in there. Double deuces confirmation for severe chaos in their life. They already have, they're about to experience more. I heard it's about to make them throw a very low vibrational, uh, her dark, uh, secretly dark, spiritless Libra under the bus. Um, because they're, they know their lives have already went into chaos and they're about to go into chaos more because of her. Um, I heard it's going to create many negative series of chain events for her. I heard through many series of chain events, um, she will end up in jail with no bond. And, um, I heard it's going to go badly for her. Um, I heard there's deaths of the past that, um, cold cases that have occur occurred that, um, she was a part of, but she does not want to take responsibility for that and many other horrible things that she has done in the past. But I heard through many series of chain events, she's about to be forced to, because information is about to come to the light. And I heard a lot of it. And apparently this Capricorn and this Virgo has a lot to do with it. So, but it's because they've already started experiencing huge chaos in their life and they're about to start experiencing more. So, you plug it in how it resonates. She's a Libra femme, dark side spiritualist. Now, you know, dark side spiritualists don't come out to the world proclaiming their dark side spiritualist. That is behind the scenes dark behavior. Like, that's not something you want to put out to the world. Hey, I'm a dark side spiritualist. No, no, I mean, that just, they don't want their public image to be tarnished like that is what I'm saying. So they don't come off to the world like they're a dark side spiritualist. It's something done in the dark behind the scenes, um, secretly or supposed to be done secretly because they don't want to ruin their public reputation, their, um, way society views them, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. It is a Libra feminine, dark side spiritualist. Um. And, um, she could be a reader or not. I didn't hear she was a reader, but she's definitely dabbles in dark arts or she did. So much so there has been at least two or two plus deaths. I heard cold cases specifically that have occurred because of her or either because of her or she was an accomplice or something to do with something she does on the dark side spiritual realm that has created a series of chain events to make them occur, I'm presuming. Um, but somehow a, a Capricorn and a Virgo is connected to this dark side Libra spiritualist or was connected to them. You could be this Caps or this Virgo or the dark side Libra spiritualist. You plug it in how it resonates. But however that resonates, these people are basically about to reveal information on her um, in a huge way. Um, I feel this could be a masculine femme Capricorn, masculine femme Virgo. They could have Caps or Virgo in any aspects of their charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Femme, and Haven, or Jupiter charts. I feel for some of you could be these people. I, in fact, I strongly feel for some of my 
people that watch my channel, you could be these people, or somebody's going to show you this video, Caps of Argo, okay? But, um, y'all woke. About to reveal so much information. So much information. Things are not going the way this Capricorn and Virgo thought they were going to. About to reveal so much information. So much. Things are not going the way this Capricorn and Virgo thought they were going to. So, you Caps and Virgo, I feel you might watch my channel or you're about to view this video. How that resonates and applies. Maybe somebody shows it to you. But, um, you're about to reveal so much information on the dark side spiritualists libra them spiritualists because things are not going the way you thought they were going to uh -huh. <clears throat> sounds like they're going down and not up, up for you <clears throat> or for somebody you're connected to how that resonates and applies so you're about to reveal a lot of information on her for some i feel it could be the um deaths the cold cases that occurred in the past it's so much information that it's going to create a series of shame events that she's going to be jailed and i heard no bond um so she won't be able to bail out, basically. And um, it's going to create series of negative series of chain events for her. Um, how that resonates and applies, Capricorn and Virgo. You're very integral in this. But it's because your lives are falling apart. Or they're just, lives aren't going the way you thought they were going to. Or whatever, whatever, whatever. Okay? An Aquarius has already gotten a huge wake-up call. And they are going to continue. And they're going to help with this. Now. Okay, so Aquarius energy too. So an Aquarius, I'm sorry, the light is just coming in in a very awkward way. So an Aquarius has already got a huge wake up call. So you Aquarius, you could be masculine or female Aquarius, have Aquarius any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine, Hayward, Jupiter charts. But you've already gotten a huge wake up call. I'm down like this because of the sun. You've already got a huge wake up call, and I heard you're going to continue to get a huge wake up call about this situation. Think about the deaths of the past, the cold cases, the connection um with these people about to basically their lives are either going down or already went down or about to go down somehow she's connected to this and deaths and basically it's about to create a snowball effect or series of chain events that's about to occur all this information leak so much information so much and a murder for hire in the past is very significant in this And an insurance policy that was attempted to be taken out on a living person. Life insurance policy. Oh my God, we've got so much going on in here. So we've got cold cases of the past, two or two plus deaths that have now are in the energetic spaces, cold cases. We've got connected to this chick. We've got a, a life a Life insurance policy that was attempted to be taken out on a living person. Yikes. And we've got, um, what was the other one? Um, there was something else. You have to go back and check it. Uh, there was something else too, but. Oh, a murder for hire of the past. Murder for hire of the past. So we have a murder for hire of the past. A life insurance policy that was attempted to be taken out in the past on a living person. Which, that's a scam. A huge ass scam. Um, and we've got. Two or two plus deaths that happened in the past, either by her hand, or she was an accomplice to it, or she collaborated in it, or something. All this about to come back on her, basically. Or has come back on her. But these two are about to make it happen. This Virgo and um, Capricorn. But Aquarius, you were significant in this too. You've already got a huge wake-up call. You're about to get a huge wake-up call. So I'm not sure who you are connected to these people in this situation is what I'm trying to say. Feel for some, you could be an investigator, or you could be the feds, or you could be um, police, or or someone else. Uh, maybe you're a family member, community member, um, member of their society or something. Maybe you hear about this through the grapevine. I'm not sure, but whoever you are, Aquarius, connected in this, you've already got a huge wake-up call. You're going to continue, and I heard now you're going to help. So you're going to help with the situation. So I feel for some of these Aquariuses, whoever you are. You could be a position of authority. Um, I feel like a bit confirmation from that's my key. Come on, buddy. And you're gonna start helping. So you plug it in how it resonates, Aquarius. This is some pretty huge things. Really huge. 
have already realized she's a huge ass liar and she's lying more now have already realized she's a huge ass liar and she's lying more now so you already realized Aquarius she's a huge ass liar this Libra fam and she's lying more now um you're highly intuitive whoever you are masculine or female Aquarius I'll tell you that you're very highly intuitive um have this Aquarius has really drowned out a lot of the noise and they are really, really, really have tuned in with themselves recently. Okay, Aquarius. Well, you go with your bad self. So you've really drowned out a lot of the noise recently. And now you're really, really in tune with yourself. So but you might have gotten your chakras aligned or getting your chakras aligned. You're really attuning to yourself. So intuition on point or is getting on point or fleet. And you're really in tuning yourself with yourself, which is good. So intuition on point or is getting on point. And um, now you're going to start helping. Um, I think apprehend this person. But this is some terrible stuff. A murder for hire in the past. A false insurance policy that was attempted. I heard attempted to be taken out on a living person. So that could have been where the murder for hire came into play. They were hoping to kill this person to take out the life insurance policy. But it didn't happen. So that's why it's a false insurance policy in the energetic space right now is what I'm presuming. And all these deaths that are connected to this chick do in the past. I mean, this is terrible. This is terrible. Once she's finally arrested on her charges, and it will be many. It's going to be very, 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 very public. Very. This was a very serious matter in the past. Very serious. And she tried to cover it up, but it's about to come out. Oh, my God. Okay, I heard once uh, she gets arrested, it's going to go basically freaking a public. Um, I heard she tried. It was very serious things in the past, which, yeah, murder for hire, person in the past is very serious, but cover up. Of the murder for hire is very serious. Um, attempting to take a life insurance policy out on a living person is serious, but it sounds like they tried to kill him and it didn't work. And that's why that happened. Killing other people is serious. I mean, this person literally goes for your life. Whoever she is. She goes for your damn life. And she doesn't matter who she takes out to get there. Um, but I think you have realized this or is about to realize this, Aquarius, and I think these people realize it too. And that's why they're about to start speaking. Um, this is crazy. Insane in the membrane. Insane in the brain. Just saying. All right, let's pull a card or two and then we'll get started. I heard it's going to go very, very, very public. So I wonder if this is like local news, national news, or both. I heard very, like it was a bunch of very. So I'm thinking it might be like, I didn't hear news energy, but I wonder if it's going to go like national news or local and national or, I mean, very, 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 very public. So I'm thinking at least in a local news, if not national, I didn't hear any of that, but that's intuitively what I'm feeling. Um, I heard this was a very serious big thing in the past. And it sounds like it was, but she's trying to cover up covered up now because she knows it was such a huge ass thing and but her plan didn't work her plan didn't work so now she's trying to cover the shit up well you shouldn't try to go around killing people for life insurance policy money the one that didn't die but yet there were other people that died but now she doesn't want to take responsibility for knowing about those things or helping kill them or being an accomplice to help them die or whatever 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 i heard she's a dark side spiritualist that's dark arts and that's just the truth i get another one we have instinct spirit messages here i like it but we're pulling in a lot of signs in here we've got um virgo and um 
Capricorn and Aquarius, and then this dark side spiritual Libra. Okay, I heard take them all. We've got instinct, breach, and blessing. And uh, reflection, I heard take that too. Okay, instinct, upright, breach, upright, blessings, upright, reflection, upright. That's what we got. This Virgo and this Capricorn is about to use their intuition and speak on everything they know about this dark side Libra spiritualist. And they know a lot. For one, it's a lover. For former lover and current lover. For one, it is a family member. For one, it's someone they grew up with. Okay, so this Virgo and uh, Capricorn are significant in this. Heard they're about to start speaking on this dark side spiritualist Libra. For one of these Virgos and Capricorns, um, I heard they're a current lover. For one, they're a former lover. It sounds like it's dark side Libra spiritualist. For one, they are a family member of the dark side Libra spiritualist. And for one, they're someone they grew up with of this dark side Libra spiritualist. They're about to start speaking on her and all these cold cases and deaths that occurred in the past and for one, they're a former business purveyor of hers. For one, they're a former business purveyor of hers. And for one of these, Capricorn and uh, Virgos, they're a former, former business purveyor of hers. So they they um, utilize some kind of business services of hers in the past, in some shape, form, or fashion. So she's a dark side spiritually, so I wonder if, they, if she sold them like spells or a spell book or... Or any other business services. But it's some, I feel it's something dark. Whatever the hell it is she sold them on the d business side. It could be light side, uh, spir um, not spiritual, light side business services for some of these Capricorn and Virgos. But I feel for a majority of these people, whoever's about to start speaking on this shit, it's probably something dark. Like spell book energy or um, spells or... Um, dark web energy or sex trafficking or human trafficking or voyeur cameraism or something like that some kind of um business services whether it's light side or dark side but i feel it for a majority they're dark side i was just giving an example okay but it looks like the capricorn and virgo is going to get blessings by breaching this information because we have the instinct their intuition they're about to use their intuition to breach the information so in this aspect intuition is strong i mean instinct is strong intuition to breach it because they know it's smart to do it um this comes up as many aspects in here this could be um like pedophilism sexual instinct uh many things um but in this aspect is intuition intuition to breach the information i'm feeling with the breach so intuition to breach the information on her something to do with spiritual um some kind of former business provider of services of hers too they're about to get blessings for doing this. They're looking back on the past reflection and realizing it is best for them to use their intuition to breach the information so they can get blessings. And I'm assuming blessings to up their life so they don't keep going down because they're connected to some kind of... She, she obviously has some kind of dark attachments, obviously. I mean, I'm serious. She's got some kind of dark attachments going on. It's like she's bringing people's lives down. It's really terrible.
The murder for hire is about to become a very, 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 very serious issue. Very serious issue of the past. And there's a lot of evidence in the universe to prove this. And it will be used. The murder for hire of the past is about to become a very, very, very serious issue. And I heard it will be, um, there's a lot of evidence in the universe to support it. And I heard it will be used. So there's some kind of evidence in the universe proving this murder for hire. I think this Capricorn and this Virgo has evidence. Or they're about to acquire it. Or maybe you are Aquarius. Somebody has the evidence already. Or they're about to acquire it. Whoever, whether it's the Capricorn, the Virgo, or the Aquarius, I'm feeling. But somebody either already has it or you're about to acquire it. And I heard it's going to be used against her in the court of law is what I'm feeling. Uh, I heard she will be jailed. And she should be. Let's pull one kipper. What? Hope everybody's doing well. I love sunny days, but daggum, when it's so sunny, I can't even get on the camera, and I'm like, I'm like, whoa. Got me like, whoa. Okay, I heard take it. We got pathway reverse, number 35. Could be a very significant number in one's life, number 35. Could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, or any other significant number, number 35. Pathway reverse. This is about to block this Libra Femmes pathway in a huge way and release other people free and clear pathway. It has been keeping a lot of people stuck. Okay, I heard it. Okay, so these series of chain of events that are about to occur between this Capricorn and Virgo releasing all this information and this Aquarius getting involved to help this situation, put her down, put her to justice, basically. Whoever this Aquarius is, mask with the Aquarius, you could be the Aquarius, could not be, but, or you could be the Capricorn of Virgo, but how that resonates, all these series of chain events about to occur in the universe to help bring her to justice, basically, um, is about to, I heard it's been stagnating other people's pathways, so I think it's been stagnating these people's pathways, because they know, like, they're accomplished energy, they know this shit, and, um, I think it's been stagnating them, like, negative karma energy, because, they're not helping the universe. They're bringing it down, and they know they are. So that's why they're about to release it. To let her get her karma is what I feel here. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard it's been stagnating a lot of people's pathways. So I think maybe it's been stagnating these people's pathways, possibly. Or some, either, in t either all the way stagnating these people's pathways, or partially stagnating these people's pathways. But... Once the information is released, it's going to change the energetic space, open these people's pathways, I'm feeling, or partially open these people's pathways, however that resonates and applies. For some, I feel if they committed help like for accomplice energy, maybe they get arrested too. I didn't hear they were going to, but really all depends how they fit into this category, like maybe plea deal energy or something. I mean, I don't know. That's just kind of what intuitively what I'm feeling, but really all depends on what information, how they were connected or what have you, what have you, is the way I look at it. But people's pathways are blocked because of her, though, is what I'm trying to say. I, and some people, the dead peoples are automatically blocked because she either killed them or helped kill them. And she tried to kill somebody else and they're still alive. So much so, there's a false insurance, po oh, there was an attempted false insurance policy, life insurance policy put out on that person, but they're still living. And I heard that's about to turn into a huge ass thing, and it should. So, pathways blocked because of this shit, basically. Withholding the information, leaving, uh, keeping it in, it's probably causing mental health, mental health issues. But the mini series of chain of events is about to open people's pathways, or partially open people's pathways, and make her stuck. Creating balance or helping create balance in the universe. This is going to uh, help create a lot of balance in the universe. Get the wheel going. This is going to help create a lot of balance balance in the universe, help get the wheel going. So putting making her pathway blocked and opening others or partially opening others is about to help the wheel get going. So you guys plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, this is a reading. All right, I love you guys. Namaste.